to my channel. If you do not know who I am, then what are you doing? My name is Cameron Webb. So in today's video, we are going to be talking about the best ways to come out to your parents and friends and stuff like that. So yeah, let's get into the video. So I did a poll on Instagram because I was running out of YouTube videos. So I asked you guys from there and it was between this video and a video of me getting burnt when I was six years old. So I'll probably do that for the next video because I really want to tell because it's actually pretty interesting. But yeah, so in today's video, we're talking about the best way to come out. So the best thing to start with is your friends. I told my friends first, like that's, that's what I would rather start with, with my friends. Cause it's like, it's easier. And then you're like, oh, okay. Thank God, at least someone like, accept me and then like i i did my parents last because i was terrified for them but i told my friends first i told them in sixth grade i really like it's up to you guys i'm not gonna tell you when to do it it's up to you like when you feel comfortable on coming out and yeah like it just when you feel like it's the time to come out to your friends family all of them then come out but for my family if you didn't see my coming out video i just i didn't do it my aunt told my mom so i really couldn't tell my mom for that so that i really don't know what you guys should do for that because i didn't tell my mom nor my dad my dad asked me if i was which that's what i'd rather prefer but like you really can't tell them like hey ask me if i'm gay or whatever you are but that's what my dad did to me <laughs> And I thought that was easier than having to tell him. So thank God he did that. But to come out to your parents, I'd feel like if you're a boy, I don't know, because for me where I'm a boy, I would figure my dad would be more, more mad because I'd feel like he would want me to be more masculine or whatever. But my mom, she's not mad about it, but she's not more accepting of it. Which I mean, oh well, I really don't care because hopefully eventually she gets more accepting. Well, she's slowly, as she's starting to slowly more accept. Like she's actually allowing me to stay at my friend Taylor's house for now on. Well, not for now on, but she's now letting me stay at her house, which thank God, because I mean, I'm gay, why would I do that? But yeah, like I feel like it's really up to who you think is going to be more accepting. Like if you think your mom's going to be more accepting, then tell her first and then if you think your dad's gonna be more accepting then tell him first so really tell who you tell one of your parents that you think is gonna be more accepting i would tell them first before you tell the one that you think is not gonna be more accepting because like i would tell my mom first because i'd figure she'd be more accepting but she's really not but yeah it's fine now <laughs> and yeah but for your friends like it really doesn't matter how you should come out to them like like i already said come out to them when you feel like you should if you haven't done it already by 10th grade i would probably tell them if i were you because then they'll be like well why didn't you tell me all this time that you happened because then they'll probably be more upset that you didn't tell them so yeah like i came out to my friends in sixth grade and that was literally easy. And if you want to know how I came out to them, go watch my coming out video. And also, I'll put that video in the description because it is a video that, like, you should watch. Because, like, maybe take some tips from that, maybe. And also, I, I guess I should, like, include, like, grandparents, too. My grandparents, like, on my dad's side. My mama and papa, they literally don't care. My mama, yes, she is scared that I'm like gonna get hurt. But my papa, he really doesn't care. Like, I, he really hasn't said anything about it. So, the only thing I know is that he's accepting and that's good. But my mama, my mom's mom is, she's accepting. She just doesn't like when I do hand gestures, which I mean, it's literally a habit and I just can't stop it. Like it just happens. And my papa, I don't know if he knows cause like I never told him. But yeah, I think he knows cause I mean, literally everyone knows. 
like you can just tell that I am. <laughs> but yeah, and like you shouldn't have like a like I'm not the one to tell you when to come out. Like I've already said. But yeah. And for like your step parents or whatever, for me, I didn't have to tell them. My dad, for instance, my dad was alone when he asked me if I was gay. So like he just went ahead and like told the rest of the family over here. And I think, I'm pretty sure my mom already did too, like on her side. So yeah, cause like my stepsister Brianna, she's like talked about it before. Yeah, me and her have, like, talked about it, I think, once that I was or whatever, something like that. I'm pretty sure she's accepting. I haven't really talked to her about it. Me and her really talk. But, yeah. I really don't know what to talk about now. But, um, this is a short video. Okay, guys, I am so sorry that this video is so short, but pretty sure that's all I have to say. If there's anything else, like, any more questions, DM me on Instagram and be in my bio. And I'll answer your questions there. Or just put them in the comments. I'll answer them there. And yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big old thumbs up and subscribe. If you are new. <laughs> and yeah. I guess I'll see you guys next time. Which the next video will probably be me when I was six years old. And I got burnt by a fire that literally blew up on me. And both of my arms and face were burnt. And I was in the hospital for about three days. So, yeah. I'll, that'll probably be next week's video. So, yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big old thumbs up. And I'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye.